Now, I know many of you send out uh, monthly statements to your customers, which probably lists many, many invoices that you have sent them during the given month for the products or services that you're providing. And so you need to be able to print a statement which summarizes all those invoices. So let's take a quick peek at how that's done, then I'm going to let you have a chance to work on that as well. I'm going to go from the Role Center. Now, I'm logged in as Susan Burke, S. Burke. Uh, because that gives me access to all the customer management type activities that we're going to do here. So be sure that you are logged in under uh, S. Burke um, for, for this process. Let's just go to customers. So we're going to go to customers and you'll be amazed how quick and easy this is. So I'm going to go to the customer list and I'm just going to pick on the Canon Group again, uh, this customer 10,000. And to print that customer a statement, the report is directly available right on the reports list. So you don't even have to open up the customer card to get to it. You can just go directly here to uh, Statements, uh, click on that. You'll get a dialog box of how you want that statement to, to look. And you kind of, uh, you know, pick and choose how you want things, include entries, we like to show the ledger entries, include reversed entries, let's show that, include, include, include a band for the uh, aging of their accounts, I like to show all these things. Then you select which customer that you want it for, so um, you can pick from the list of customers or just select the Canon group. And you also want to be sure to assign a, a date filter. I'm just going to do this as of 3-1 of 10 uh, for this example. And I'll pr uh, rather than printing it on a printer, which you would normally do uh, to send it to them, I will preview this report on the screen so you can basically see it. Here is the uh, actual statement. You'll, of course, want to format this or purchase a block of pre-formatted uh, reports that have already been formatted for uh, statements and invoices and so forth. And here's a listing then of all the overdue entries and their dates, the amounts, um, the due dates on those entries, and then the totals down here. And then the, at the very bottom, it's the aging brackets. So it shows how that uh, amount is aged uh, for that customer. So this again is the uh, statement. Uh, and you would print this as a hard copy and mail that uh, to the uh, customer or fax it or email it, depending on how you want to uh, distribute your statements. Thanks so much. Oh, and do the exercise. Try and do the same thing that you've seen me do here uh, so that you know how to print customer statements. Thanks so much.